fight their rivalry. I have a feeling we'll be in for some more exciting golf as these two battle it out. Let me show you how Certainly excited to see this one. Strap yourselves in. Oof, fast. Fast, good lord. Perfect. Kick left. Oh, Henny, that looks like a putrid lie. Is it bad? This is what bad luck looks like. Just off the fairway, but sitting really down. Look at the line on this one. Get in the hole. Might, no, it, it really won't get in the hole, the but it's close up enough. Nicely through that bad light. This one's for Birdie. Move it over that much. Get it in for Birdie. Look at this one. Yep. Well, that's a nice way to start, writing a little red number down on the scorecard at the first. I will take Can't a birdie for all, sure. Unless you birdie the first, Luke. Good start. Length really isn't a feature, mm, Rich, at the yeah. Detroit Golf Club. Yeah, the second, one. bombs away. Bombs away. This is probably one of the strongest par fours on this golf course. Ooh, Basically just a straightaway hole. Just take driver out and get with it. Second shot should be coming into this green with some kind of short to mid iron. Fast. Oh, I didn't see this as possible. What a shot. Neither did I. This putt is about 15 feet to the hole. Looking for another birdie here. Oh, yeah, this is tracking nicely. Oh, what a super shot. Gonna like it. Two in a row. Why don't we catch up with Brooke Henderson? She's got some work to do. She's two strokes behind so far. Oh, that one just missed the hole. You almost buried Let's take that a look at the hole. leaderboard. Oh, thank God she did not birdie that from the bunker. Reached the third hole, not too dissimilar to the first. It's not in length, 390 yards from the back of the tee. Again, need to hit something uh, about 280 that's yards that's to get past the fairway bunker down the left-hand side. Again, with a short iron in their hand, Might players are up, looking to make birdie. Here. This is Brooke Henderson. Wow, that's bold. Henny, how bad is this lie? This is like a bad lie with a bit of grilled bad lie on top, sprinkled with dashings of bad lie. I'll take that. Not bad. Not bad Always at all. It's nice to have a booty putt. This one might be a little bit more straightforward, but we're just going to kind of... Oh! That's frustrating. That's fine. Hard you finished your work on that hole. Let's take a look at the next one. The par 5 fourth is a monster. 616 yards. This is a big par 5, isn't Fast. it? Tee shot, yeah, if you have ooh. any hope of reaching this green and two, must find the fairway, avoiding the fairway bunkers down the left-hand side. From there, you'd have to hit a really strong three-wood, moving it from right to left to try and chase it up onto this green. Laying it up short and right of that fairway bunker We're going might drive be a play for most deck. players, setting up a pretty easy pitch shot for their third. Not quite sure about the strike on that one. Yeah, this could be heading towards quick. the rough. From the sand, looking to get up and down. Not bad. Yeah, magical shot out of the bunker, that one. Pretty straightforward four-footer coming up here. Nicely played. Moving on up the leaderboard now after that hole. Rich, this uh, par three Go fifth really iron. resembles a Donald Ross. An elevated green, and you miss anywhere, and you're going to struggle to make your three. Absolutely. Reminds me a lot of something you'd see at Pinehurst, where there really isn't a flat spot I anywhere right for that specific around reason. the edges of this green. So a quality iron shot is a must on this par three. Not bad. He has this putt to save his par. I'll get the par, right don't you worry. They were looking at. Well, that'll don't you worry, I got the par. Nice par putt. Gotta say, 
putting this well from this distance is a huge confidence booster. Fast. At least it's going to be in the Bad middle of the fairway. This one. Perfect. Second shot here on the sixth. Not perfect, but perfect enough. Going with the pitching Man, wedge a here. one that time. Yeah, not a bad effort, that one. Up onto the green and a chance to hold your putt. Here's Brooke Anderson. That's brilliant out of the sand. She is Which bringing has moved it. Deeper under the card. This putt's for four under. Oh, I like the look of this. Now that's a good putt to hold any what day. What a with. putt. And with that, he'll move to four under par. What a putt. That was awesome. Four shots back. Well, if you're not a couple under already through six holes here at Detroit Golf Club, you'll want to look to make a birdie at least at the par five seventh, measuring 555 Fast. yards. Yes, a hole that, that every player in this field must take advantage of. Just the fairway bunker down the left-hand side that needs to be avoided. You find the fairway, and all of a sudden you're licking your chops. As you know, you can reach the green in two, setting up hopefully an eagle putt. Anything missing over in the left-hand bunker, though, could get a little dicey. This par, is their fifth shot. Watch her hold it from the bunker. Oh, and there it goes from the sand. At least it was for par Let's and not for birdie. Let's return to live play now. Chance to sneak into the top five here. Ooh. This is, ugh, this is gross. Ugh, it's gross. At best, it's going to be a birdie putt. Go in. Yeah, birdie putt. Ooh, Close. right by the hole. Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. He finds himself in a share of 10th place. The eighth is a short par four, measuring just 360 yards, Rich. Decision to go for it or just to lay it back? I like going for it eight days a week, twice on Sunday, as you well know, Luke. So I'm going to go ahead, take out driver, and give her a whirl. Hopefully avoiding the trees over on the right-hand side. Want to hit it over in the left-hand bunker or just shy of it, setting up a very simple pitch shot. Oh, that was pure. Just nine feet remaining to the Ish. hole. Ish. Little birdie looking here. Like that. That starts off on a good line. Oh. Mm, just hammer that through the line. Got that and one. it goes for the par. The opening nine finishes with a par three, rich around 200 yards. A strong hole indeed. Not much to this green. Slightly downhill. Green is fairly flat until you get to the back left portion of it. There it starts running away from you awfully quickly. Anywhere in the right Thank center God of the green go the is green. a gorgeous tee shot. Here's Brooke Henderson's next shot. Why am I not surprised? Oh, stop it. What a way to make your par. And now she this is why you can again. never get comfortable, even if you're leading a PGA Tour Pro. This is what they do. They mean business. Boom. Boom. Really good, this one. Mark or it six down. Now. That's six birdies today. And that will move Keep him to six under par. Three shots Rich, back. good position for this player. Just three back with nine to play. Do you sense them making a charge? Yeah, three wins, yes, driver. but three back with nine to go. They're going to have to start taking chances. They're going to have to start firing at every flag stick they can see. What are you reading my mind? Right Looks like the they middle. got all of that one. That's on a good line. Perfect. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. She's currently trailing her rival. Let's see what happens here. Wow, did this come out beautifully. And she's hold it. Absolutely magnificent. Oh. And that'll promote a good move up the standings. Damn. Time for the second shot at the 10th. All right. Fast. Needs a little members bounce to the right. That's fine. I'll take well, that's that. That's well played and sets up a good birdie look here at the tenth. And as good as they putt, you almost have to guarantee this one. You just Putting had to say here. that, didn't you? 
And after that performance, they'll stay Jim's right me. where they are in the standings. Oh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. Now that looked pretty good the whole way. Slim chance for a birdie, but in all reality, two putt for par would be just fine. Just didn't drop. This putt's about four feet from the hole. There it is. Currently six under for the event. The 12 hole, Rich, uh, a good test, particularly with a tee shot. It is a demanding Oof. tee shot here. Want to avoid that fairway bunker. To carry it, it's about 300 yards. Should you get past it, you have a mid iron into this par four so. that you'd love dearly to make par on. Lovely rhythm there, Rich. That's going to work every time. What do we catch up with Brooke Henderson? Yeah, she's down. She's behind her rivals scooting ahead. Let's see what happens. You going to hold it again? What a shot. Almost went in the bucket. Wow. That is Sitting at that's six crazy. Under in a share of seventh. I might have pulled Ooh, it a this bit. Handy if it could bounce right. Hey, it's yeah, that in was place. a safe play. And this putt to move into a tie for third place. If it's up, it could be in. There it is. That's a lovely putt to make for Birdie. Take some pride in that one. Step aside, gents. This man's marching into the top five. The par 413th oh, is a short me, one, buddy. measuring just 385 yards, Rich. Are you expecting players to go after this? A few of them will, but I'm not too sure. That turned I out like better than I thought play. it was going to turn players out. Players basically want to lay it up down the left hand side, but don't get clumsy and knock it in those fairway bunkers. Anything out to the left hand side is going to set up a very short wedge shot for their second. Ooh. All the players will be bad. thinking about making birdie on this par four. And a chance to move into a tie for second here. Uh. An opportunity to make their par. Misjudged it a the bit. Putt drops, and we're moving on. Just five holes remain in the round here, and there's some birdie opportunities starting with the par 5 14th. Yes, at 560 yards, you just want to make sure you avoid that bunker down the right hand side. From there, most players will be able to go for this green in two that is surrounded by water on the front and two deep bunkers over there on the right hand side. It's a wonderful opportunity to get some confidence over the last four holes by knocking it on in two. Needs a little ground help to the left. Thank it. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. She's trying to pull ahead in this group rivalry. Let's see what happens. Oh, terrific. What an effort. Oh, she hold it? <laughs> this one out of a smelly spot on the golf course. How but no bother for this player. And this putt to move into the top five on the leaderboard. Well, how good's that for the eagle? Hey, my that. first eagle awesome of the day. The top five now. I'll take it. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. Getting closer to that top spot on the leaderboard. This Ooh, is getting this interesting. Be, uh, we'll hit it past the hole by a little bit. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. At least yourself safe. an opportunity. Slim chance here for birdie, but you never know. My eyes are good every time. Almost every time, that is, but this time they're perfect. Big chance here. Boom. And with that putt hold, now double digits under par. Minus 10 as we head to the final few holes. Oh, we got Sweating some kind of battle here going on out there. And let's have one more look at that shot. Just a what few holes left. an amazing putt from way out. It's a 
31 foot putt. Still hard to make. I just hope I was hoping my eyes. And He's I currently tied for right, first. But, you know. Whew. Three holes. All right, Rich. A couple of strong par fours remain. Starting right here at 16. 16 is a wonderful par four. Very difficult driving hole. That's and must a good keep one. it out of those three bunkers that dot both the right and the left hand swing. side of the fairway. From there, you're going to have a second shot that's fairly flat into, funny enough, a fairly flat green as well. Still, players are looking to make a solid four here. Nothing worse. Perfect. Oh, stop it. What a shot. And this one for back-to-back -back birdies. And with that putt hole, I didn't think I was going to hold that one. Birdies. And I like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. I did not think that was going in at all. Why don't we catch up with Brooke Henderson? She's currently trailing her rival. Let's see what happens here. Get the it. hell That'll out of here. That'll be for Birdie. It's almost like the golf ball Get had eyes here. and it went straight where it belongs. This woman is in shooting right now. The last of the real scoring holes comes here at the Banana Hole, the 17th, the par five, stretching at 575 yards. Most players will be able to well, get it over the, the fairway bunker the down the left-hand side, some 275 yards off the tee. And from there, it's a pretty straightforward second shot with a long iron, maybe a fairway wood. Those who elect to lay up have to be mindful of the fairway bunker down the left-hand side. You can't get careless and knock it in there. Anywhere up and around the green, though, with your second shot, you should have a good opportunity to get it up and down for the birdie. Sitting at I don't know minus if I'm three. It in from here. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. She's been chipping She's it in all day. And now just burning the last hole. And back to the play, shall we? And here we are with the third shot. He shares the lead. Not Ooh, bad. That almost went down. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. He's currently in a share of top spot. The finishing hole reach, an old world hole. classic. It is definitely that. Players are going to want to aim out to the right-hand side, away from the bunker and the water that is down the left-hand side. And from there, they're going to go in with a short to middle iron for their second to a green that tilts pretty significantly from back to front. Fast. This truly is a wonderful finishing hole. Get this putt to drop. And he'll win the event here. Mm. This one's tracking. No, it's not. Oh, no. That's a heartbreaker. And Luke, they need this putt. And just like that, we're going to a playoff. Woohoo! Cannot Sudden wait. death. This player made a massive charge the last few holes. And in the form they're in, they've got a great opportunity to win this tournament. Oh boy. Aim over here. Glad I aimed right. Had a boy. Good shot. Well, what's your advice here, Rich, with the opponent so close to the hole? Only look at the flag stick, look at nothing else, hit your shot, and hit it close. That's not close. Four left. Ooh, what a time to chip one in here to win the event. Didn't that look good for a long time? Great touch. Really nicely but to played. to continue. Gotta say, his short game is phenomenal. And that'll force this playoff to another hole. Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Well struck. Now this putt to win the Rocket Mortgage Classic. Eyes didn't fail me. Get it in there. Oh, you know you want to. And ladies and gentlemen, there is your Rocket Mortgage Classic champion. Great Two performance this week. And, we and got a great it. win on an old style golf course by this player. Way to go, our Rocket Mortgage Classic Champion. I was sweating bullets on that one, man. That was a long putt, too. Got a 
judge it right. Pull out. <laughs> Well, that's how you take care of business, Rich. Closing it out on the second hole for this player. Congratulations. Well, thank you, sports fans. Hope you enjoyed all the coverage of our playoff finale. And from myself and all the dedicated people at 2K Sports, thanks for tuning in. Catch you next time. Ten birdies, one eagle, no bogeys, no double bogeys. It's really hard to get an albatross. <laughs> Oh, but I'm going to sign off here. We're going to end this on a good note. <laughs> Catch y'all later.